Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, Christian Mechanic. I hope everybody had a great uh, last Thanksgiving. I know I did. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Okay, so I got another little uh, pickup for you today, guys. This is another Harbor Freight product. <clears throat> excuse me. These are Doyle. These are made by Doyle. They are the uh, flat nodes assembly pliers. The part number is 57791. <clears throat> and they're 8 inch. And then these are also lifetime guaranteed. And it says here on the front, crosshatch teeth for superior grip and strength. So we'll see. We'll take a look at that. That says on the back, it says flat nose design, evenly grips, materials without slipping, high strength steel construction, optimal durability, rust protection, reduces corrosion and increases tool life. Aggressive cross hatch grip zone for ultra for an unrivaled hold. Plastic dipped handle provides comfort during extended use. <clears throat> and these are made in Taiwan. So we'll just go ahead and I've already uh, pre opened these. So I got a little tape measure here. So we're going to measure just to make sure they're 8 inch, 8 inches long here. And they're pretty much right on the money, 8 inches. So they are 8 inches long. Um, take a look at this, the cross hatching here on it for you guys. You can see that. Get the focus. There you go. And there's the cross hatching, and it's on both sides. Now, I do a lot of uh, repairs with electrical, electrical, electrical equipment and stuff like that. <clears throat> so these would be great for just going in there and just uh, grabbing a wire. You know, if you drop a if you drop a screw or you know you're trying to get a screw in a hole you know my hands are a little little shaky sometimes so it's kind of hard to get those small screws so it's nice to get you know a nice screw in there and you can hold it and as you can see it's I'm wiggling it back and forth and it's it's in there pretty tight so the cross hatching does work but yeah you can put a screw in there and then when you're trying to get it in the hole you can help you know set it in the hole to get the get it started um, now there are no uh, there's, there's no cutting edges on here, as you can see that. It's just, they're just pliers. There's no other, it's not a multi-purpose tool. And you can see on the inside of it, there is some, uh, it's like it's got some black, black paint or what, or some kind of finish on it. So they, uh, they didn't, uh, the inside has the black paint and then the outside of the uh, steel is polished. And you got laser etched here into the side of it, the uh, dual logo and it's just got a regular just a pin just a regular pin through it and i'm guessing it's they just uh sanded that nice and flat once they pinned it through there i'm not sure how the pin is actually held in place if it's riveted or whatnot but um they're not super loose <clears throat> but they're not super tight either so they, these feel good like i said uh there's no uh there's no back and forth play in the jaw here, so there's there's no wiggle, there's no wiggle room, nothing like that. The uh, the grips are nice, the grips feel good. Uh, like I said, it's a, they're dipped, so they're not a uh, they're not a super hard plastic, so they're kind of soft, so that's good. And it's got a little contour here, a little contour right here for your uh, for your hands, depending on how you want to hold them. But yeah, the uh, like I said, the uh, all the sanding and everything, it looks pretty good. There are some machine marks, uh, as you can see on this part right here. They didn't polish this edge too uh, too well, but they did a good job on the sides, polishing the sides up. The sides look good. It would be nice they would have polished a little bit more on the very top of it, but <clears throat> not too bad. Uh, these were, I think, $14.99, not on sale, so... Um, you're going to pay full price for these if you uh, buy these right now. But yeah, I, um, I've been looking at these for a while. Like I said, I got a bunch of different kinds of, uh, just different kinds of pliers, but I don't really have any of these nice flat nose, nice wide assembly pliers with the cross hatching, uh, you know. So these would be good for that. Anyway, guys, I just want to thank you guys. Uh, hope you have a great day. God bless you. Stay safe. Uh, like, subscribe, leave a comment. I'll try and get back to you. All right, everybody, take care and have a good day. Thank you.